Hi, this is Kurt with Grimberg. Let's see how the Solstice magazine piercing mechanism works. You have the magazine right here. The CO2 goes in here and it screws on with a cap just like our gavel launcher. You prepare the magazine ahead of time. Also, right here is where the projectiles are loaded. There's a projectile, goes in there. You push them down the magazine before you put the next one in. Next, the magazine goes into the launcher. And you, you hit it, pops up. Once the CO2 is pierced, then the gas pressure inside the magazine pushes it back down again and you're ready to fire. Here's the next thing that happens inside the launcher. The piercing pin lives right here. On the top of this magazine, there's a tiny hole. Inside that hole is an O-ring. And when you insert the magazine, the piercing pin goes into the hole on the top of the magazine and two opposing neodymium magnets, or neodymium, however you say it, magnets. There's one in the magazine here and there's an opposing one in the bottom of the piercing manifold. So they, it takes about three pounds to compress them together so they touch. So once you insert your magazine in there, it's being held by the magazine release and held apart by these magnets. If you can see here, this magazine uh, release slot is pretty tall. It's actually double the height, you can see, right there. So it stays up at the top here. When you push the magazine up, the piercing pin, which is through the O-ring already from the beginning, it's, it's already in this hole, there's an O-ring. The piercing pin lives already pushed through the O-ring. So there's a gas seal right there. Now, when you hit the magazine from the bottom, you're puncturing the CO2 with the pin and the gas pressure pushes it back down. But the pin is still inside the O-ring and that becomes a gas seal, just like on our bolt and inner bolt design for the gavel or the carry or the solstice. Here's our bolt. The gas pressure inside the gun is behind here. This is hollow. This is our bolt guide. There's an o-ring inside there and inside here is uh, the bolt plug. The, when they go together and the sear locks up this tries to come forward from the gas pressure, but it can't because the sear is stopping it. And the O-ring is making a complete seal around the bolt plug. That's exactly what's happening inside this magazine right here. It's, it's the same thing. So after you puncture it, the pressure pushes the magazine down. And now the top of the magazine is in line with the bolt and you can fire. That's the whole thing right there. Hope it made sense.